The previous video introduced parametric curves. That video made the point that a parametric curve is more than just a shape. It is the description of movement along that shape with direction and speed. Therefore, the same shape can be described by many different parametric curves. These different curves are all called reparameterizations of the same shape. Let me formalize this idea. Say I have a parametric curve gamma with coordinates x of t and y of t for some time domain t and a, b. To make a reparameterization, I need to substitute t with a new variable, much like I do with integration substitution. So I set t equal to g of u for some function g. What is important about g is that it is monotonic and continuous. Monotonic means that the movement along the curve will still be in one direction, though it can go backwards compared with the original. Then I will replace t with g of u to get a new curve gamma of u. This curve will go through exactly the same coordinates, but with a different rate determined by the function u, and the domain also changes to match the new variable. As a matter of notation, the function g is sometimes just written t of u to indicate that the old variable t is now given by some expression in the new variable u. Let me show you how this works with a circle. Here is the parametric description of the circle, with cosine as the x-coordinate and sine as the y-coordinate. The movement around the circle is uniform. Over time, the speed is constant. Now what happens if I replace t with u squared? Well, I need to change the domain to match, so the domain is now u from 0 to the root of 2 pi. Then u squared covers more of the circle later in its domain since u squared accelerates, which means that the movement starts slower and then accelerates and is faster near the end of the circle. The opposite happens for t equals root u. I again change the domain to match, so it is from 0 to 2 pi squared. The square root covers less distance over time as it goes along, so the movement along the curve is now decelerating, taking longer to move along near the end of the circle. The point of these reparameterizations is to clearly distinguish between the shape, which is the circle, and the rate of movement along that shape. There are infinitely many parameterizations of any one shape. This is the richness of parametric curves, to include all of this information about movement in their definition.